Working from home during a pandemic can be tough, but adding teacher to the list of special skills makes things much more complicated. I thought, honestly, I was a very patient person, and I thought I was this great teacher, and I could teach people, and I realized maybe I just can't teach kids. Brittany Mason works from home and teaches her four-year-old daughter, Brooklyn, everything from how to count to even how to create a composting bin. It's hard to call customers with Paw Patrol on in the background, mm -hmm. and then really just trying to come up with a schedule that worked for her and me. Mason says Brooklyn doesn't get that social interaction with other kids her age, but she's decided to wait and not send Brooklyn to daycare or preschool this year. She won't keep the mask on to go to the grocery store, let alone to sit in school, and she doesn't understand. She's not going to understand why she can't sit so close to her friends. So I think it's just almost a fear of not knowing. And that fear is something Father Jason Holder is familiar with as well. You know, you have a lot of different kids coming from all different backgrounds and um, just it's a lot having to get them on the same page to where everybody's practicing social distancing. Holder says his children want to go back to school and he wants that too. But right now, his family is still undecided. We're excited at the same point. We know there's going to be challenges, so just making the best decision for our children and our family is what we're definitely going to take our time to do. Both Holder and Mason say they're relying on other family members to help take care of children when they return to work. But some parents may not have that option. In Saginaw, Veronica Gabriel, WNEM TV5.